Imagine an undiscovered flaw lurking in the tech you use every day. Someone is using that flaw and stealing your personal information. But hold on, the worst part is that you have no clue. This flaw is called a zero-day vulnerability. What exactly is a zero-day vulnerability and how does it threaten our digital world? Stay tuned to get all the information about the internet's biggest shadow threat. Simply put, a zero-day vulnerability is a cybersecurity flaw in hardware or software that developers and vendors don't know about. This open-door flaw causes significant damage, especially in the hands of a hacker. In most cases, zero-day vulnerabilities are the gateway to zero-day attacks, where valuable data is stolen or compromised. It's a cat-and-mouse game between developers and cyber criminals, because fraudsters launch these zero-day exploits and try to steal as much as possible possible before a security patch for these vulnerabilities is released. Unfortunately, this race with time is sometimes a losing battle for developers and users. Many zero-day exploits come with a heavy price tag. The WannaCry case is no exception to that. The malware targeted zero-day vulnerabilities in the Microsoft Windows operating system. It infected thousands of computers around the globe and encrypted specific files. Later, the attackers demanded ransom payments in Bitcoin for the decryption. Zero-day vulnerabilities can become powerful weapons. In 2017, Stuxnet appeared on the horizon. Stuxnet was a computer worm that targeted Windows vulnerabilities. The worm infected about 200,000 computers and caused enormous damage to Iran's nuclear program. It destroyed nearly a fifth of Iran's nuclear centrifuges. And at this point, it's pretty clear that zero-day vulnerabilities are dangerous and can impact anyone on a personal, corporate, and governmental level, simply because there are no available security patches at the time of discovery. No designated tools detect these vulnerabilities. And finally, targets are usually corporations or governmental infrastructure. The sad truth is that protecting yourself from zero-day exploits is challenging. Our safety depends on software and system developers' reaction time and how quickly they can develop new security patches. However, practicing good cybersecurity hygiene can improve one's security. So it is necessary to install the latest security patches for known vulnerabilities, use advanced security tools and alerts, or gather information on recent cybersecurity threats. Stay safe online.